The mystery surrounding the coronavirus immunity. Why are some able to fight off the virus without any symptoms at all, while others become dangerously sick and hospitalized? As WBZ's Bill Shields explains, the answer will be the key to finding a cure. Why is it that when some healthy people get COVID-19, they end up in the hospital while other healthy people don't even know they have it? Maybe there's something about a person's immune system that is different that we can't really identify. Hi, everyone. This is Brian O'Neill two weeks ago in isolation with the virus. The 49-year-old Cambridge firefighter had mild symptoms. What did you think in the beginning? Well, I got a little bug, I got a cold. I mean, what were you thinking? Yeah, no, not, not even. Uh, it was actually, it was Easter Sunday, um, and I lost my sense of taste and my sense of smell. Researchers around the world are trying to figure out what makes some immune systems fight off COVID while others cannot. Something genetic, like perhaps uh, the receptor for this angiotensin converting enzyme, um, is different in some people that might make them more or less susceptible to the virus. Maybe something in the lungs, uh, this stuff called surfactant that kind of lines our lungs. Maybe there's a difference in some people. No one is wondering more about immune systems than Brian O'Neill. Why are my symptoms so mild? And obviously I was concerned that they were going to get significantly worse, uh, which they didn't. Uh, and other people are dying from this disease. And for whatever reason, whatever it's a different strain or the antibodies or something. Scientists around the world are still trying to figure out COVID-19. But perhaps our immune systems or the antibodies in our blood hold the key to therapy and eventually a vaccine. I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. The vaccine would be great. Bill, thank you for